Hey what's up guys, in this video I will be showing you how to install the Synogen Mod 12 based on Android 5.0.2 Lollipop on your OnePlus One. So this is one of the stable builds from Synogen Mod. So before installing make sure to keep a backup of everything important cause you'll be losing all your apps and data. In order to install this ROM you must be rooted and should have a custom recovery installed. Importantly TWRP recovery. If you don't know how to do that you can download the root toolkit and follow the instructions. I will leave a link for it in the description. From the link to download the ROM and the G apps, then copy it to your internal memory. Once done, get the quick boot app from the play store and boot into the recovery mode. So as you can see we are in the TWRP recovery. First go to wipe, go to advanced wipe and here select Dalvik cache data and cache. Once done, swipe to wipe. Ok so that's done. Go back, back. Now go to install. Over here you need to select the ROM file, the CM12 zip file. Select it and swipe to install. So this will take some time, just be patient. Ok that's done, now go back and this time you need to select the G apps, that is the Google apps and swipe to install. Ok that's done, so the installation is complete, now just hit reboot system. The first boot will take some time, just be patient and I will be back with you guys once we get back. So that's the new boot animation. Ok guys, we have successfully installed the CM12 on the OnePlus One. So quickly skipping through the basic setup. So few new icons with this update. Multiple profiles where you can add guest users. Now quickly going on to settings. Over here we still have the theme support. Then we have the gestures through which we can launch apps. So that's nice. Going to about device and as you can see here we are running the Android 5.0.2 Lollipop. We get the new dialer and the keyboard from Android Lollipop. New icons for messaging, music player etc. So quickly launching the camera. So the camera works perfect. And another good thing about this ROM is that this ROM also receives OTA updates. So that's really nice. So basically all the basic functionality like the Wi-Fi, flashlight, 3G works perfect. So that's all for this video guys. If you cannot wait for the official CM12 update, you can install this ROM. Stay tuned for more videos and you guys have a great time.